Hi, Jason Haxton. How are you? Hello, Sandra and students. I'm fine. Well, hello, everybody. Uh, here we are with uh, Jason Haxton, uh, director of the Museum of Osteopathic Medicine at Andrew Taylor Steel University. I think we all know him. So uh, we have we are we are lucky that we will have him uh, in the international virtual online day for OSEN students and Jason will be presenting a very interesting lecture so please uh, Jason can you tell us a little bit more about you and about your lecture hello everybody I'm excited to be lecturing with you my name is Jason Haxton I'm the director of the Museum of Osteopathic Medicine, the only museum of its kind, at Andrew Taylor Stowe University in Kirksville, Missouri, where osteopathic medicine first began being taught at a school. Okay, so uh, what, what's your lecture going to be about? What, what are you going to tell us? Well, I find from giving lectures all over the world that one of the favorite topics is, how did osteopathy come to be? How was it discovered? What is its main philosophy about? And how did it end up getting back to Europe? And so all, all of these are the ideas of, of great stories to tell. Um, why osteopathy had to happen in the United States, but was very much helped by European doctors, and then went back to Europe to become a standard form of healthcare. So we're gonna have a lot of fun learning these ideas about osteopathy and how it fits with what you do. Okay, so I think it's very important to know where we come from in order to understand where we are at at this moment, don't we? <laughs> so uh, why should students follow your lecture? Why, what do you think that you will offer them? Well, here's the thing. You need to know where you come from in order to do a better job. And so what I think our lecture will do is help you understand the foundation. So when someone comes up to you and say, well, what is it about? Why, why aren't you a physiotherapist? Or why aren't you a chiropractor? We have a very unique history and a very proud history uh, that comes through medicine 58 medical schools in the United States and hundreds of schools like yours all over the world. So I think you need to understand your roots in order to better appreciate what makes you unique and different. And we're going to do this in a really fun way because that's how Dr. Still would have taught it. I know him better than any other person after 20 years. And my job, instead of making you read dozens and dozens of books, is to take all that knowledge and give it to you within an hour. We're gonna have a lot of fun and I look forward to seeing you. I'm sure I'm already looking forward to it. So thank you very much, Jason. Uh, so I hope uh, students will be there and I'm sure they will enjoy it very much. Thank you very much for being with us. Okay, we'll see you soon, bye-bye.